So here we want to find the indicated slope. They want the slope of the line that is perpendicular to this line. So first, what is the slope of this line? In order to find it, I have to convert this line to slope intercept form. So the first thing I'll do is subtract x to this side. Negative 4y equals negative x plus 11. So since I subtracted it, that's how it becomes negative. Then I will divide each term by negative 4. So now I have y equals 1 fourth x minus 11 over 4. So the slope of this line equals 1 fourth. So the slope of the perpendicular line is going to be the opposite reciprocal, negative 4 over 1. So we find our slopes by converting to slope-intercept form, and then perpendicular lines have opposite reciprocal slopes. So let's look at number four. Find the slope of the line that is parallel to this line. So remember, parallel lines have the same slope. So my slope should be equal. So first, I need to convert this equation from standard form to slope-intercept form so I can identify my slope. First, I will subtract 5x. Negative 3y equals negative 5x plus 11. And then I will divide by negative 3. And I'll have y equals 5 thirds x minus 11 over 3. So I want my slope to have the same slope as this line. So m equals 5 thirds. So now this next part of these notes, let's go ahead and keep um, this page here as a warm up for us to discuss together in class. And I will see you then. Have a good one.